Sometimes when I'm sitting in my office, I just want to help myself to a Coke and a smile. What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. I like having a frosty beverage from the can sometimes. And when I am sitting around, it's nice to be able to just reach over and grab one conveniently without having to get up and walk 10 feet to the refrigerator. So I picked up this, not only because I just wanted a refrigerator, but because I am a Coke fan. I love this retro look. This is by Coolertron, and it is a desktop pop vending machine. I've always thought they were cool. They're definitely kind of a novelty. You can get much larger, small fridges for less money than this, but it won't have that retro vintage look, will it? So this is all modern. It's plastic here. Yeah, you can see it's just like ABS plastic. It's not super heavy. Uh, it's decently heavy, but you can certainly carry it around with just a person. Then we have the Coca-Cola script up here. Nice little handle. Has definitely that vintage look to it. It looks like this part is about 11 or 12 inches deep, and then you have this refrigeration unit on the back that actually extends out another few inches and you can see that we have a fan and then we have an on off switch here a little led a dc and ac plug and then on the front we have the coca-cola script here and all of this chrome including the coca-cola is chrome plastic so it's got a nice shiny finish to it we have a clear plexiglass window down here we also have a clear plexiglass window right here where the cans will be dispensed and that's where we have the power cord we actually have two cords it looks like you could put this into the cigarette lighter in your car so you could actually take it with you say your tailgating or something like that then you have a two prong plug right here so that you can plug it into a regular outlet and so what you can do here is load up pop inside so i'm just going to pull this door open here. now this is all really just a novelty because you could certainly just open this door there's nothing protecting it there's no coin slot or anything like that and just help yourself to pop but what we can do now is put the pop in here in each of these and in the back here what i'm noticing is that there is a little flipper right up at the top and that looks like that's going to rotate as these little buttons on the side get pressed by these bigger buttons on the outside and the mechanism here is pretty clever when you hit this button not only does it allow this flap to fold back so that the can will drop back but when you push this in there's a little stopper there so the second can in front of this won't roll back so you actually won't dispense two cans at the same time which is pretty clever i think that will allow a can to drop so if you hit that once can will drop down and then roll all the way to the back there's a kind of a almost like an elevator shaft on the back where it's gonna drop all the way down. And then it'll fall all the way down to the bottom here. This little tray is removable, so if it gets dirty, clean it out there. And then you have down here, this little plastic door that you can just push in and grab your can when it dispenses. So let's load this thing up and try it out. Looks like you can put two cans per slot. And now if I just close that up, as it's cooling, I can help myself to one of these Doctors of Pepper by pressing right there. Look at that! Falls down here. Booyah! A frosty beverage at the ready. Hit any of these buttons? Yeah! That is awesome! Hey, this is pretty cool. I dig it. For 150 bucks, it adds a little bit of vintage flair to your man cave or office or home and it's not that wide it's only about nine inches wide so it'll sit pretty much anywhere you can put it on a shelf put it on your desk put it on a table it's really easy to reload and it's fun to vend if you want to pick this thing up i'll put a link to it in the description below peter von panda out